Okay, taking a quick break in a set of course uh, from the Japanese tracks, which there are still a lot to go through and have a lot of fun with. But um, Itra 2K um, was a viewer that commented on uh, my California drives, uh, some of the the things that I've done, like Mulholland, uh, Santa Monica Mountains, uh, Pacific Coast Highway, etc. Uh, also, one of my favorite uh, is just the California Highway uh, hill climb. And he said that I should try out a California 9 to Saratoga uphill. And I've actually driven this road in real life. Um, it is a fun road. And this mod, while the road is pristine, great feel, great feedback, and a lot of fun for competitive purposes, um, the scenery is a little bit unfinished. And there are some other odds and ends that you'll see as we drive through, like the road signs are patently European, not Californian. Um, and also to the pure settings for weather, if I set it to live, it thinks that it is right now the middle of the night um, and it is not. So something set up uh, with the geo in the map is, is incorrect. All those things set aside, um, I said that I would drive it and I'm going to. So let's see what we see. One of the things that I'm also working on, working the bugs out of my dual PC recording setup, I wanted to take the load off of my driving machine so it performs a little bit better, a little bit crispier um, while recording to multiple places simultaneously. So I get horizontal and vertical all in one shot from uh, my recording sessions. While I can use something like, you know, uh, a video editor like uh, Adobe Premiere to uh, take widescreen footage and turn it into short uh, vertical format for phones. It's kind of a pain. I mean, you can do it with templates and stuff, which, you know, that's all good, but I prefer to just record it in that format using the ADM uh, plugin for OBS, um, which is actually quite nice. The vertical plugin is pretty sweet. So I can reuse sources and do some other really cool things. So one of the things that's kind of been uh, an irritation for me so far is I'm using Voice Meter Banana to capture audio um, to get it to the recording PC. And uh, the irritation there is that it's introducing some delays, and there's some ways to tune that, and I'm working on that. Um, but I haven't quite gotten it to where I'm satisfied with the quality of the output. So we will see. Um, I did some more tinkering before recording this to see if uh, I can get it a little bit better uh, than what it was. So this is quite a nice road. I won't lie. Although the center line does a little weird stuff there. shift there. Complained a little bit about that. As I said, you can see, you know, the unfinished aspects of this, uh, the hillsides and stuff aren't quite finished uh, like some of the other tracks we've been driving. Hanging trees, signposts in the middle of the mountain. The road surface is really quite nice though. You can feel, feel it in my hands for force feedback. You see the, the signs there are not California typical signs, they're more European in nature. So probably the author of this is from Europe. 
or used what he had at his disposal from another map that he liked. Rather than uh, recreating a bunch of stuff. I do like the map though. The road is phenomenal. It's fun to drive in real life too though. It's been long enough since I've actually driven this in real life that I can't quite remember all the turns, so I can't tell you how accurate it is, but it feels accurate. beyond adhesion there. exhaust my uh, Japanese tracks. Of course, this is not a Japanese track. Again, this is California 9 uh, headed to Saratoga, and this is the end of the map. It does go a little bit further that way, um, but uh, <laughs> it just ends and you fly into the abyss and wind up back at the starting line if you push beyond this point very much. So, um, as I was saying, i um, been doing a lot of the Japanese tracks and I love those. Those are a lot of my fun and I, I think probably my favorite so far. Um, but I also, there are some great big maps um, that I've also found uh, that are pretty cool uh, that I've already driven, uh, Glen Shale, Glencoe, um, some of those that were really just incredible for really long drives and good conversation. Um, so what I was gonna say is uh, once I get through the Japanese tracks, I'm gonna continue to go through that and just sort of find some more interesting ones and share those with you. But if there are other places in the world that have good maps um, that you wanna see, um, either here or otherwise, would love to see that. Um, you t just give me, tell me what they are. Um, I'll pull those up and load them up and we'll do those drives. So uh, thank you very much for joining. Hope you've enjoyed this as much as I have. And uh, I'll see you on the next one. Thanks. Spaß machen Rennsport.